From this moment on, you will now be known as Sharkbait. Sharkbait, ooh ha ha! Welcome, brother Sharkbait. Sharkbait, ooh ha ha! Enough of the Sharkbait. Sharkbait, ooh, bop, bado. Well, good morning, everybody on YouTube. This is D from Brooklyn, the assistant chiefy with the Blizzard update. So, seeing how that New York is under the crazy blizzard, as you can see by my deck, what a perfect time to just go over some emergency prep for the old aquarium phase. So, we got snow outside, and what we want to do, just in case there's an emergency, it's hard to see the tank because everything is dark. Lights haven't come on yet. But one of the things that I'm going to do, seeing how you never know an emergency, you can lose power or anything, is A, check that the power is working. The apex is working and maintaining the temperature, pH, and all the other basic requirements of the system. Protein skimmer needs to be cleaned out, which I will do real quick. Top off and everything is running. So what I'm going to do there's the lines to my backup system you want to make sure that you have power in your battery backup units are running there my two battery backup pumps are up and running we want to make sure that the temperature in the room is maintained at a uh, acceptable number just in case the power to the aquariums goes out and the same would go for the planted tanks. The planted tanks have a little bit of an advantage because the plants will filter the water. They will also utilize oxygen. So, once again, same thing I have for my saltwater aquariums. I have battery backup units, which I want to make sure that I have batteries for them. Make sure that they are in place and available in case we lose power. Uh, since this tank is in my basement the temperature is a little colder down here so that is a bit more trickier than the in the other system which is on the main floor and gets more heat as we getting heat in the general space so you don't want to feed your tanks anything at this period just in case you lose power there's my fish saying well why the hell did you turn the lights on buddy I'll be turning them off in a minute I know he's a little PO'd um, so just a general prep. You want to make sure your batteries are up. You want to make sure that the tanks are maintaining temperature. As you can see, everything is still up and running. I have my big battery is charged and on the floor. I have this unit here by the ready as well as my inverter. I have two inverters. One for upstairs, one for downstairs. And that is basically it. I have my generator sitting by the ready. What you might want to do in this situation is make sure you have gas for your generator. Or you might have to siphon a little gas out of your car just in case. Because in an emergency like Sandy, I remember there was a big mad dash for the gas stations to make sure that everybody got gas. Which, of course... Uh, used all the gasoline and made that another issue so uh this is d from brooklyn just in the first blizzard of 2014 going over some emergency prep steps and i hope everybody stays warm i hope no one loses power and keep your sanity keep your family safe enjoy 2014 and enjoy your aquariums thank you everybody for being subscribers to my channel my Facebook channel as well you know DFB Aquatics D from Brooklyn Aquatics I, I'm just happy to interact with all of you guys and my goal is always to help everybody else the way people have helped me grow in this hobby and be successful and enjoy our fish so everybody stay warm and safe keep your sanity by keeping your aquarium